This is Danielle for rumbum.com. I'm here with Bob and Matt of Flogging Molly. You guys just finished a crazy set in the rain and you guys gave the finger to everybody. Or they gave it to people for you. Who were they giving it we to? We were giving it to the, 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 to the man. I think we are giving it to the man. Yeah. Right? The, 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 man. The, government. the governments of our, of our fine countries. Mm -hmm. yeah. They've kind of sent us up. How do you guys feel being at a festival like this where it's pretty rock heavy and you guys have that punk edge? Is it fun to be kind of kind of a, a different a different sort of set compared to the rest of the festival? I think if it, it, usually it's either the Irish side or or the the kind of punk side that sets Set us you. off. Yeah, so we're, we're fairly used to being a little bit off the center mark. Mm -hmm. It's fun. Yeah. What what's your favorite thing a fan can say to you or react to in in your shows? Uh, Anything that just blows you away, like when they're out there and you see them really makes you happy while you're performing? I guess when they're just really, you know, I mean, when they're having a really good time and they're feeling what we're doing, then, then, I, then for me personally, and I think as a band, like, we just feel like we're succeeding in what we're doing, you know? Like, we, we, we love this music and we love playing music, and when, when we see people smiling and going nuts, then, then that's about as good as it can get. As far as I, I, I as far as I'm concerned, I think as a band's concerned, I think it's as good as it gets. I love it when a kid comes up to me and says, "My grandpa turned me on to you guys." Yeah. That always makes me feel good. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel like your songwriting has changed in, in the years of collaborating together over almost what is it like six, 16 years? Yeah, like together? 14 years. 14. But uh, I, I think I think hopefully we're becoming just better musicians. So well, I think hopefully we're always striving to do what we do a little bit better than the time previously, you know. So at the end of the day, as a band, hopefully, um, damn, it's fucking pouring, right? Uh, <laughs> uh, we, we're doing we, we do, we're doing in, things better. Uh, we're doing things better than, than we previously were. Just you know, uh, not not only in what we mean to do and what we want to do, but actually in musicianship, you know. Mm -hmm. How do you bring your awesome live energy into the studio when you record? A couple of pints doesn't hurt, and uh, I don't know. We just try to set it up as much like a show, you know, like play mm -hmm. play it as much like we would in a show in the studio. And you, you can never you can never capture that because there's no sweat and and beer and you know like and crying and screaming in, in the studio. But uh, but we actually really do try to make it set up like a live show for us mm -hmm. because that's where I think our band shines better than just recording for us. That's how it works for us. Awesome. Is there anything you guys would like to say to the to the to the audiences out there? Thanks We've for been sticking coming. it out in the rain tonight. <laughs> it was awesome. It didn't let up once. Oh, I'll suck in that. It's it's pissing. Thank you very much for hanging <laughs> out. Thanks for being here no, with no us. Worries. Thanks for having us. No worries. Awesome. Cheers. Cheers.